What's up, friends? We're back for more Last of Us Part 2. Excited to get into another session here. Left off with a point where we're just going to be straight into the action, it looks like. And so I'm ready to get started. Got some clickers, got some regular zombies, or an infected. I have noticed it when I record that I keep calling them zombies, even when they're not. They're infected. I'm hoping that we can find some more shotgun ammo, since we ran out before. Uh, well, I don't want to toggle my flashlight yet. Are those all clickers? I think one of them's a regular infected. So got to be careful of that one. That was that was close. Did not realize they were facing this direction. I guess they're the only one in here. So might as well make my move now. Hoping that this playthrough doesn't contain the emotional roller coaster that last one did. Hopefully, it still has some exciting moments, though. The last one was definitely rough. Can I get this one if he's looking down? I think so. And I think there's one more regular infected. Yeah, right in there. Once, once we get this one, it should be a little bit easier. Because we don't have to worry about clickers spotting us. Okay, one's in there. Dina's making a lot of noise. Thankfully, that doesn't matter. Almost turned around. Okay, this isn't as bad as I thought it's going to be. And I'm hoping that this isn't the last place that we need to go. Because I feel like there's a lot more that we can explore out there before we go to the dome. Which right now is what I think is the place we're supposed to go to. Last, at least. I think this is the last one. That was a pretty efficient run. Did it hear me right at the very end? It's too late though. I'm as quick as a cat. The death noises it was making, jeez. Okay, I think we can just run around now. Let's find that gas. Hey, what you yeah. talking about, team? I did all the work. I wonder what it was like to serve on a jury. But it was fun. Sit down, look at evidence, try to tell if somebody's lying. <sighs> Just give me five minutes of my knife. I'd tell you if they were lying or not. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> nice, <Okay>. silly. <clears throat> Everybody always thinks jury duty is fun. And then I feel like once you get into it, it's not. Are there more already? I heard somebody. Maybe it's on a different floor though. And I haven't really had the chance to say it on video since my last session included it, even though there was like another hour afterwards. But the more I think about Joel's death, the more to me personally, I feel like it's one of the best executed death sequences I've seen in a game. Just all the aspects of it I felt were done so well narratively and gameplay wise. And it's definitely been something I've thought about recently with like shows and stuff. Is how too many hey, creators... Hello. Coming. If they're talking I'll wait a bit. Just want to make sure there's no infected right here. 
You ever been to a courthouse before? Nope. You're telling me you never got in trouble back in Boston? Oh, I got in trouble. <laughs> but never landed in a courthouse. Yeah, I feel like that's probably not much of a thing anymore. They just throw you in a cage like we saw earlier. Um, but I was saying before, I feel like almost no creators anymore, writers or whatever in TV or movies, have the guts to kill off major characters, at least during a show or something, not just at the very end of something. And so I got to give them credit here for having the balls to go for it because you'd never expect something like this. Use a stun bomb to stun multiple enemies. Cool. And finish them off with strike attacks. Okay, sweet. That's a new gadget. Let's see. Oh, I can make some stuff. Uh, let's make a Molotov. Because I needed one of those last episode. And I didn't have it. Uh, I was going to check journal stuff, but I don't think... Hell, he's written anything since I last signed off. What was that noise? Parking garage. Oh, the gas is in there, right? Well, that's what the note said. Well, let's get down there. Uh, level 3, Magistrate's Office, Probation Office. Level 2, General District Courtroom, Judge Salazar's Office, Attorney Study, Level 1, Lobby, Bailiff's Office. All the way down at the basement is the parking garage. So this does feel like the place where we're supposed to go, but... I can definitely jump down there if I want to. I feel like the game will let me, but I do not want to. So, I guess I'll just keep going and hope I can still explore later. Okay. Oh, we got a safe. That's what I want to see. Okay, I just got to find the code. Not on there. It's probably in here. Prep. Survival guide for the silent majority. Todd Garrett. Um, can I look at it? Like, open it up? Because it's not letting me rotate or anything. Okay, I guess I'll just hang on to it. Oh, interesting. That's what it did. That's a cool sound effect. Um, okay, I still can't do that. Okay, nothing new there. Well, no, okay, it doesn't actually let me read it. See, it's not on the wall anywhere, nope. No dog photos here, it looks like, unfortunately. Oh, very easy. There's the code. Known WLF agitators. The following people are our top priority targets for any anti-terrorist operations. Emma Patterson. It's crossed out, so I assume it means they're dead. Jason Patterson. They got the, all the Pattersons. Marcus Wilson. Smuggling acts of terrorism. Luis Sanchez. Isaac. Okay, I feel like Isaac may be the leader of the WLF because he's been on all the notes. He's obviously a target here. Acts of sedition as well. Hugo Gonzalez and Allison Cole. Haven't seen those names. With the Pattersons and Sanchez is gone, Dixon has voted in to fill the void. Has moved in to fill the void. Let me just read it here. He is now our top priority target, Sergeant Ward. Okay, interesting. So, I have a feeling we might meet up with Isaac eventually. This might come in handy. Uh, 
Oh, another note. This room has all the goods. I'm just gonna read this one. For official use only, Fedra. This guy was a Fedra commander or something. Uh, they were losing to the WLF and trying to escape. How big is this group if they were able to beat the army? That's what I'm saying. Well, you don't need a lot if you're that vicious. We need to be careful. Let's just be smart about it. <laughs> okay, Jesse. <laughs> Okay, subject, Seattle QZ compromised attention, Captain Paul Douglas. Despite our best efforts, the Seattle quarantine zone will fall to the terrorist group calling themselves the Washington Liberation Front. We underestimated their capabilities and lost key sites around the city. We have executed our contingency plans and are prepping to escort key personnel out of the QZ 24 hours from now. Is that maybe the car that we saw or the truck that we saw with all the killed agents? I wonder if that's their contingency plan that did not go very well. I intend to stay until the last officer has escaped. Let the record show I provided for the city and its citizens as best as I could. They are now freed of us and are at the mercy of the WLF. Let's see how they feed and shelter a community of thousands. Let them deal with dissent among their own ranks. Let them deal with those religious fanatics. Inevitably, someone else will come along and hold them accountable for all their perceived wrongs. It's going to be Ellie and Dina. I almost wish I could be there to see it. Okay. The WLF just must be the worst. Doesn't look like I recognize any of those images. There's Isaac, though. Okay. Because the bottom three are the ones that are still alive. No, I think it's just Isaac and Marcus, maybe. Okay, code 860722. 860722. Hopefully there's some good stuff in here. Gotcha. Looks like it. Bunch of pills. I think I may have enough to upgrade. I'm not sure. No, I do not. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, I feel like I want to save up for maximum health, but let's see what this other stuff is. Oh, okay. I didn't recognize it because it was locked before I remember now. I guess I can upgrade this one. I'm sure eventually I'll have enough for more health. Okay, I think I'll make... Uh, another med kit. Just in case. You never know what's coming up. I feel like we got everything in this room. Which was a very cool room. Had some good notes. We learned more about Isaac. Oh, missed that. Jeez, yeah, the WLF just murders everybody. Because this does not look like they were infected that killed him. Benny, the WLF is winning. The city is going to fall any day now. And unless you quit Fedra, I can't keep you safe. Up until recently, I could almost understand why you stuck with them. But after the Thursday market massacre, I don't see how you can call us misguided killers with a straight face. Those people were just trying to get their food for their families, and today they started banishing people for sedition? That's a death sentence. Listen, you still have time. I can, I will vouch for you. Meet me by Rustin Coffee at 2am on Friday alone. Please show up. I know it's scary, but it's the only way. Your friend, Sandra. Well, I don't think she made it for that meeting. So is she talking about the Fedra agents as misguided killers and the WLF? WLF was the one massacring people. I feel like it. Brought it on yourself, I guess. That's <laughs> kind of harsh, Shelly. Oh what no! Now? Don't don't give me a hint. That I was is. just exploring. Oh, I guess it does want me to go down here. Do I just? Maybe I jump to the rope? Yeah. Careful. Oh, that's right. We can climb stuff. Can I get over there? 
Or is that just another shaft? Yeah, well, let me well, let me jump. Is Dina coming down or am I doing this solo? Does not look like an inviting place. Shit! Headshot. I I'm running. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It's tense, man. It's tense. Can I just... Oh, no. <laughs> Dina shot, so we have to shoot it. Was not ready for a full-on brawl. Jesus. I think that's all of them. Those guys never even made it out of the garage. Damn. Well, let's find that gas. Yeah, it's gotta be down here somewhere. Just wanna loot the bodies real quick, because there's a lot of them. I'm not climbing back up over here. I wonder if we can get into any of these cars. I doubt it. It usually doesn't let us get into cars. That might be something. Just want to check over here real quick. Oh, there's something flashy. Oh, here's some gas. Come on. We're definitely gonna have to hold this area, I bet. Empty. Oh, never mind. Seriously? That giant tank? Yeah. Just tapped out. Bet WLF, WLF well, took it all. Look at the dome. I don't know why that is such a tongue twister for me. Well, how do we get out of here? Huh. I already know. It's right through here. Well, let me boost Dina up. It's got to be there, right? Maybe we have to move something? And maybe it'll let us unlock these now? Oh, here's something. Dina, come in. Doesn't look like anybody's waiting for us. Okay, let go. Good job, babe. Thanks. <laughs> They're at the babe stage. Okay. Cross the courthouse off the list. Let's go find the dome. Good. I'm glad we can still explore out here. Some supplies before we press on. What are you thinking? No gas, unfortunately. Let's see, we haven't really touched back here, and it looks like there's a lot of stuff over there. I don't think there's anything over here. There might be something in this little post area. Oh, yep, definitely, there's a question mark. Love it. Just need a workbench. I wonder if we can get in there. We can break the glass. 
That might have been what she actually marked down as a question mark. Already with a note and a gun? Giving us guns everywhere. Hey Davis, check out our old WLF safe houses for supplies. Probably a long shot, but every little bit helps. Grab it you can and meet us back at the Saravina. Don't worry about the gas, we'll take care of it, Mike. Okay, so that's why the gas is gone. Oh, will it not let me get the gun? I guess maybe because I already have a similar one. Fall in love with our autumn flavors. Everything is pumpkin. Wasn't Joel all about coffee? Kidding me? He trade half his stuff for a bag of beans. I never got it. it tastes like shit. <laughs> Calling Thank him you. out. Acquired taste, my ass. Oh, our first mammal. Big blue, brains a hundred, brawn eighty. Holy affiliation none. Big blue is an extra dimensional entity who has taken on the appearance of a blue whale. First arriving on Earth over a billion years ago to keep watch over nascent life forms. They use their infinite well of knowledge to help guide the human race in times of great need and upheaval. Their unfathomable age has one major drawback. Days appear to pass as microseconds. However, this time dilation effect is offset if they hold their breath, which they can do for several years at a time. What in the world? Some of these cards are overpowered. I could use a hot chocolate right now. Oh, is it really wanting me to break this for that? I guess I will. That might be enough pills to upgrade again. That one got me. <laughs> that one was rough. Barcos. Yeah. How do they get inside these places? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I hate that shit. I'm gonna have to read it. 900, Marion, and 6th. Okay, I feel like that's gotta be a place on the map that we can go to. Oh, it added it for us. Oops, meant to hold. Let's see. Oh, okay, it's the flashing one. I guess we will go there next. Uh, someone had Taco Bell, it seems. Nothing else in here. I'm enjoying these areas around here, giving us lots of good loot. Just make sure we didn't miss anything. Got another bottle. Some health. We cleared this place out. I think so too. It's peaceful out here, at least. It's yeah. weird being in a QZ and not hearing trucks or gunfire and explosions. My sister always avoided QZs. That's probably why. She just got more and more paranoid. She'd sometimes wake up screaming in the middle of the night. That's rough. We always had a backpack so we could bail if something happened. Never stayed in one place for more than a few weeks. It sucked. At least she survived, though. That's the good thing about it. I think it was right around here if I'm... Oh, yep. I see the sign. Okay, we could go in through the back. Let's just make sure we can't go in the front. Some more wanted posters. <laughs> Easy there, Dina. Okay, here we go. Oh, 
Oh, shit. I got it. Let's see what we got in here. Hopefully there's no infected in here. Since it's a locked the door. Is this place? Some kind of WLF something. Yep, there's their mark. They think we're sheep. Bury your fangs. What is that? WLF propaganda. Reminds me of the fireflies in Boston. In New Mexico, we had these guys called the Ravens. Protectors of the Constitution, they called themselves. Oh, yes, let's talk deal? more. ex fedra types who thought Fedra had too many rules. They ran protection rackets. They took multiple wives. Great dudes. Ugh, yikes. Yeah. Seems like there's all sorts of fanatical groups around the country. Not surprised. What is this? Goonian ghost would have loved this. Is there anything? Oh, does that let me have another gun? That's cool. Oh, perfect. Now I just need to find shotgun ammo somewhere. Um, who? <laughs> they were these feral cats I had before I came to Jackson. But they didn't seem to want to leave with us, so... I miss those scratchy little shits sometimes. You have any pets? Nah, it was never really my thing. Oh, well, maybe when we're done with all this, we can get a nice little creature to take care of. <laughs> all right, deal. As if I couldn't like Dina anymore. She's a cat person. What's this? There's the Here's convoy. The Recognize convoy. that. Man, the WLF just wiped the military out. Way more successful than the fireflies ever were. Okay, added a question mark up there. Let's see. Columbia Center. Checkpoint. Petra HQ. Wow, yeah, that's a pretty big group of people. If they can spare that many for each place they're attacking. Surprised there's not a workbench in here. I'd feel like since it was a outpost for somebody else, that they would have that. Um, so when we exit, we want to just go keep going straight down. And let me see if I can build stuff. I can. Let's make another Molotov. Can't make one of those yet. But I'll make one of these. And I'll make another Molotov. So we can pick up health sometimes along the way. 48. We could increase crafting speed. But I don't think I want to do that. I want to get more health. That's most important. I think we got everything here. Okay, so it should be like this building right here, I think. Can we climb this? I don't know if we need to. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Uh, let's go over here, because I kind of already looked in that area. Could take the horse, but I felt like this is close enough. Getting awfully close to the dome as well, which is kind of scary. Hey, Valiant Music Shop. Should we check for supplies? Let's check for some music. Some guitars or Man, something. Imagine this place when everything was intact. You could just goof off, play some instruments. I bet we could scrounge enough stuff to start a band. <laughs> you don't know how to play anything. I mean, I could definitely figure it out. <laughs> yeah, why not? Not much else to do in the apocalypse. I 
feel like we have to be getting all the cards. We're getting a lot. Yo. Das what? Why was Dina saying yo to me? Brains 80, Brawn 80, the new dogs. That's a new one. This tall, laconic presence seems unassuming enough. Bullied and misunderstood early in life due to his inability to speak above the level of a mumble. He was forever changed when ancient cosmic beings bestowed upon him the word. A mystical phrase that when spoken or even muttered will drive everyone in earshot insane. Could use that. Thankfully, his considerable height often gives him away and allows his potential victims plenty of time to run or plug their ears. Wow. Seems like a pretty powerful person if he gets up to you. Check this out. Oh my gosh. Oh, wow. That was... That was an interesting beat. Excuse me. I am a natural. Admit it. I love you. Whatever. <laughs> We're starting a band. How about you be my... Groupie. You're what? Well, okay. Fans apparently had these hardcore fans that would just follow them around. Isn't that what I'm already doing? <laughs> uh, I guess so. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Dina seems like the next to Robert Plant to me. Still waiting for Ellie to play a song. Dang, unfortunate the sale didn't get to happen because of the apocalypse. Now I can climb up here. <gasps> Worried I wasn't gonna make it. They got a bunch of records here. The sleek habit. The sick habit. Close enough. Uh, okay. We only listened to it like a hundred times together. I was only listening to it because I thought you were cute. Oh well, I guess we cannot open that. I'm gonna try this. Whoops, didn't mean that. Guess it took a bit more. Nice, is that like... Kind of look like a rip on a Beatles type album cover. Could spend all day in here if this was me. Love browsing records. Pearl Jam. Lightning bolts. Uh, I feel like that's all there is for us. Can go into this room. There you go. You gotta bring that. Or at least play. Finally. Forget that we Whoops. Is the remix? Joel's song. Nothing. Hmm. Well, nothing sure sounds nice. Remember that night by the bonfire? Yeah. How oh, cool we get to do some more. I don't 
to say, I'll say anyway. I love this song. Today's another day to find you shying away. I'll be coming for you, I'm okay. Take on me. Take Got a great voice. You should have kissed me then. <sighs> I wanted to. Me too. All right. We should keep moving. Yeah. That was a wonderful moment right there. Just not worrying about anything else. Infected, WLF. I'd say that Joel's lessons definitely paid off big time. Oh, we can look at it again. I can practice. I definitely need it. L1, R1. Okay, what does that do? Oh, it'll just let me free roam? Here, let me, let me play you guys an original Brandon. All right, you ready? Okay, I was kind of tapping it there. Let me. Okay, there. That's it. That's what got me signed the first time. And I don't mean to brag, but I did go platinum. I think we could probably just hop out this window. Oh, there's a Don't little think path. There's anything else in here. What if we didn't take in everything that was in there? Would Ellie still say that? A lot of squirrels. They're definitely thriving. Oh, that's a note. Damn, that's pretty good. I'd say. Looks like this is a rendition of what it looked like before the apocalypse. Looks really nice. Let's see. Let me orient myself. The dome. Oh, it's right there. So are we heading to the dome right now? Let me just... Oh, we got another question mark there. Because if we go in here... Okay, it won't take us to the dome. Is that shotgun ammo? Please tell me it's shotgun ammo. Yes! Finally. Gotta be a little more careful with these bullets in the future, though. I assume if you're close enough, it's like a one-shot. 
One shot kill. Is this a workbench? Yes. Been asking for one of these. And got two new guns we can work on. Let's see what we can do with shotgun. Is there a range option? Stability, capacity. Nope. Probably don't need any of these right now, especially with two bullets. Let's look at this gun, because I really like this one. Got fire rate, stability, reload speed, damage. That's a 70, though. And I could do two of these or just the damage. And I feel like if I'm going for headshots, I don't really need damage. I'm going to go for stability. And then I'll go for reload rate. Okay, that's a pretty good reload rate. Uh, plus 85%. Excellent, and I only have three left, so that's definitely all. Finally, we got one, though. Been a minute. We can sneak through here. Don't need to use the generator, I assume. Nothing over here. Can't climb up those. Okay, we're making some good progress. I climb over that? Nope. Where's our horsey? Horse is just gone. He dipped. Didn't want anything to do with the infected. Okay. Go to this building next, I guess. Unless... I always... I always press it. Just mean to hold. Okay, we gotta go check what this other question mark is. Oh, he just <laughs> appeared out of hey. nowhere. You nervous at all? About? After everything we found out about the WLF, they seem more organized than I expected. Doesn't change anything for me. Just means we have to be more careful. At least they don't know we're coming for them. Exactly. We're gonna be okay. I know. I feel like they may be expecting somebody to follow them, but they won't know when or who. Okay, this has to be the question going? mark. There's something back here. Oh, I'm surprised that there isn't anything there. I wonder, yeah, I was just about to say, I wonder if it's one of the codes. This is Gate West 2. Okay, for some reason I couldn't find it forever, but I finally got it. West 2, 0451. Gotta be something good in here, if WLF are keeping it. I guess it would have been quicker to go the other way. Oh shit. Whoa, the mother load. That was some good scavenging. Clean this place out. They kept a trading card in the safe? Oh, that's a pretty cool looking one. Olga Kuznetsova. 8080 Society of Champions. Graduating at top of her class from a prominent sci-tech university, Olga was recruited by the Russian government to further their research into dark energy. Fearing the tech would be used for war, her attempt to sabotage their experiments resulted in her consciousness fusing with water vapor. Now she is able to control her soul into any body of water and conjure objects in any form of water so long as there's moisture in the air. Dang, so like a waterbender on steroids. Let's see, let me make sure Ellie hasn't written anything new on the map. 
Okay, so I want to go explore down that direction because we haven't really gone too much over there. And thank goodness our horse came back, so we don't have to just go on foot. Hey, that building's got something on top I'd call Dome Lake. Nothing in there. Yep. Saw that Wait, from the right. very beginning. But I don't want to go in there yet. It's on the map now. I have a feeling though the dome is gonna be kinda empty. But who knows? They could have a bunch of Fedra agents, or not Fedra agents, WLF in there. Uh, this place sturdy? I don't know. Yeah, let's scavenge first to ask questions later. <laughs> Got another brick there as well, just in case. You don't have to worry about me. Parkour legend. I feel like with so many items here to scavenge, uh, we gotta have a massive fight coming up. Dr. Ukman, 160 of the new dogs. Once a well-respected researcher, Dr. Ukman's questionable experiments in the realm of pushing human limits saw him ostracized from the scientific community. Even the morally compromised Laurent Foucault of Spark Laboratories found his work dubious. Underrated, undeterred, Ukman continued his work in secret, creating super AI to do his bidding and protect his research while he and the new dogs stage high-tech heists to fund it all, constantly moving his lab, location so no one can find him. He longs for the day where his subjects will be treated as equals. Let's hope the WLF don't move their location as much as he does. Okay, I think that's everything here. Man, there's so many spots here. I knew it was going to be open when we first rolled up, but did not expect it to be this open. I doubt there's anything there. Uh, might as well look. Don't think we can climb up it, but... Oh, maybe there's something in these? some files. I guess nothing worth reading though. So that was all for nothing. Hey, get back here. Where are you going? Oh, that's the one we already went to. Uh, there's some stuff there, and then I'll go under that crumbled building. Oh, it's killing me by not rewarding me for Roman over there. Can we jump on top of this? Guess not. Has to be something here. Is that a... Hmm. Somebody was camping here. Looks recent. Think it was Tommy? Maybe. Okay, sorry if that was an abrupt cut right there. My camera battery just died for some reason. It's only been under an hour. I don't know why that would have happened. I guess maybe it didn't charge fully or something. But I would assume that this fire was Tommy because I don't know why WLF agents would be camping out here if their base is nearby. So, it's a good sign if he made it this far. Hopefully we don't find the WL WLF group and Tommy's already dead or something like that. 
Whoa, check out the tank. Can we actually oh, climb inside? In action. Oh, yikes. These guys had a bad day. What is it? Burnt skeletons? Oof. Not how I'd want to go out. How much ammo we get? Hey, that was a pretty good haul. Let me reload real quick. Okay. I can reload this too. Similar satchel to before. I wonder if it's in the same group of people. Oh, it's Isaac again. Roger, following up on our fight from last night, I hear concerns and understand your reluctance. But listen, we've thinned Fedra's numbers. Many of their soldiers have joined our fight. And knowing they plan to sneak out through the tunnels, we have a rare opportunity to deal a final blow to Torres and his thugs. If we let them regroup, then how many of our men will die? Our own have to come first. You know that more than anybody. I'm glad you're asking these questions. There are questions leaders wrestle with every day. I'm proud of the growth you've made, the soldier you've become, and the leader you'll be one day. Man, Isaac just seems to be sad. very manipulative with people. Trying to build up his ego just because he wants his own objective. I assume they're talking about the hit that we saw earlier. That might actually be all of the spots that we can hit here. Yep, nothing to get there, so... I think it's just dome time now. Which, we're close enough. I don't think we need the horse. Just make sure there's nothing on those. Okay, we got an opening there. Ration distribution center. In Boston? We'd line up for blocks. And the food sucked. I'd go crazy. Well, some people did. Come on, let's find a way in. So we want a yellow ticket. That's messed up though. Even in an apocalypse, there's still a class system. Okay, just making sure there's nothing over here. Alright. Been waiting for this moment for a minute. Let's hope it's worth it. Fuel distribution. Here we go. Fedra secured the shit out of this place. Boston always had food shortages. Hungry people get desperate. Sightseer. I wonder if that means I hit up all of the destinations. Oh, didn't we hear from Sergeant Ward before? Private Miller, we've got fresh intel. There's an active WLF hideout on Spring and 5th. Grab any available soldiers in your sector and head to that hideout ASAP. Execute any suspects, secure the location, and await my arrival. Well, if it's the one we heard about before, or read from before, did not go well, obviously. Let me just look one, la uh, one last time on the map. Yep, just one big question mark remains. Feel pretty accomplished though, getting all that done. Oh, it's not gonna let me jump down like it did before. Just in case. Let's see, it feels like uh, no. We can probably go down there. It's a closed gate. Got a whole lot more ominous, though. Can you get through? Wait, wait, wait. No, I don't want to go yet. Oh, I wanted to go up that other place. <laughs> Dang it, I hope I didn't leave anything important there. Oh, interesting. So does that mean I can just climb like this? Or crawl like... 
I guess that tip wasn't too helpful. I thought it was tall enough grass. I think we dropped all of them. Yeah, looks that way. Oh, I can't get back in there. Shoot. That kills me. I feel like it would have been something good at least. Can I restart checkpoint? Oh, it just spawns me back here. Shoot. Okay, let me just finish all these and then I'll skip ahead for you all. I mean, if it was just an optional area, it's probably just some loot, but there might have been a cool node or something. Looks like we can actually get into it. Maybe not, though. Is it going to actually work this time? I guess I could also go prone in tall grass. Let me... There we go. I thought that was one stuck behind that tree. I think that's all of them. I don't get it. If there were still people around, they would have cleared this place out. Good point. Maybe they didn't make it here. Yeah, maybe. Let's find that gas. Finally was able to use a Molotov. Been waiting for the right opportunity. So I think my assumption or my prediction might have been right that there was nobody here. Hopefully they aren't too far away. Oh, it is empty. That might have gas, but I have a feeling there isn't going to be much here. Oh, shit. Latch is on the other side. Found the gas. Just need to get back there. I feel like you could probably reach hey, your hand through there. This place is a synagogue. How can you tell? Uh, one, there are menorah decorations on the wall. It's a Jewish thing. And two, I didn't burst into flames just now, so... Burst into flames? <laughs> it's just a dumb joke. Oh, unlike your other ones? You shut it. Ellie always with the comebacks. This place brings back a lot of memories. My sister used to drag me to a synagogue all the time. You never struck me as much of a believer. Nah. But I like coming from a long line of survivors. You mean after Outbreak Day? That. And the Inquisition. And the Holocaust. My family always made it out alive. Whoa. Barely. Man, that is a tough history. No wonder Dina is so good at surviving. Okay, looks like that's all down here. Except we can probably go in here. Nothing with these doors that we can do. Not very much in here, have to say. Okay. 
At least we can get in here. Oh, yes. Need this. Nothing else in here. Nope, doesn't look like it. All right. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, language. It's a house of worship. <laughs> we got some gas. Oh, fuck yeah. Dina's funny. Okay. Now we're in business. Hey, through here. Do you still pray? Sometimes. Really? When? I said when when we left Jackson. I said when at Joel's grave. Sometimes I just say little ones to myself. Nice. Does it help? I think it calms me. Helps me put things in perspective. It's a way to deal with grief. A way to show respect. It's what I know. I like Dina's character. There's a lot to her. So do we just go back out the way we came? Like it's kind of tricky to get back up there. Nope, doesn't seem like we do. Maybe these front doors will let us open them now. That's a negative. Uh oh. Okay, what is the play here? It's probably something so obvious. Oh, duh. Took me a second, but we got there. Any help would be much appreciated, Dina. Doesn't look like Ellie's struggling too much. I think that should be it. <laughs> I kind of want to put it there so I can climb up there and get what I missed, but don't think it's possible. This way. I can lower that, but that'll probably start something. Let me look here. Hopefully no infected jump out. What's this? Oh, this is the Torah. The what? Uh, it's, it's scripture. It's like a... Like a Jewish Bible. Hmm. My sister would have flipped for this. The one we used in New Mexico was half burnt. All right. Well, at least they didn't just chuck everything. Have we ever learned what happened to Dina's sister? I would assume the way that she talks about her, she died, but did an infected get her? A human? I guess that's all that's in here. Got a bit of dialogue, though. Kind of nice. Oh, why did it... Why did it turn me like that? Will it not let me... This? Oh, I guess Dina had to get it. Hmm. That might work. Huh. Oh, I thought we were going to swing over there. It's okay. It's holding. Oh, well, this is kind of cool. I actually think we will be able to get back there, which is awesome. So all my worrying was for nothing. Slowly getting there. 
Uh, I scared myself. Uh, oh, I just clobbered Dina. Nothing to it. Come on, Dina. Right. I got some photos here. Fifty-seven seventy-four. Are we in the future? No, doofus. That's a Hebrew calendar. For the new year. My sister used to give me an apple dipped in honey. Ugh. Now I'm craving it. it does sound pretty good. Oof. That does sound pretty good. <laughs> hey. Jewish holidays are all about food. And celebrating not getting annihilated by our enemies. A long line of survivors. Exactly. Lieutenant Torres. Okay, that's a name we've seen. 70 years ago, my grandfather fled Germany with his family as World War II began. He escaped thanks to the kindness and bravery of a Polish family. And so the wheel turns and the cycle continues. Tonight, my family has packed our belongings. And due to your kindness, we will be leaving the city escorted by your brave men. Thank you for helping me preserve what we could of our shoal. It is difficult to leave our home behind, but in the end, it is people, living people, that matter. You bear a heavy burden on your shoulders, and I hope our late night talks were of some comfort to you. If I can leave you with one thought, for every turn away from a better world, there is often a stronger correction towards it. Do not lose hope for the future. As the old saying goes, it takes but one candle to dispel the darkness. May God watch over you always. Rabbi Ziva Saunders. Man, that's sad, because we obviously know the WLF got to him. Okay, let's see what we got here. When I think about him, all I see is open skin, slack jaw, insides out. Oof, I won't let her remember me that way. I'd rather die alone. Did she die alone? Was God with her? Was her God with her? Was he with you in the end? Was he with Joel? Did I make it worse for Joel being there, or was I company? He, him, more than I was with him. I wonder who she's referring to when she says she. I feel like could be referring to maybe her mom, but also could be referring to Joel's daughter. I'm not sure. Beyond faith in pain, I want faith through pain. Interesting. I assume that's the rabbi and his family. Man. Nothing else in here, it looks like. Yeah, this organization just straight evil. Thank goodness for my own sanity. We can come back through here, although... Doesn't even look like there is anything to get here. Nina's going back in, I guess. Okay. Gate. So where do we go now? I thought that was the objective. I guess we can go farther to the left. But we kind of already went over there, right? Guess we can just keep going to the left. We'll try it all right around a bit. Onward, Shimmer. Such a cool name. How you doing back there? Getting homesick? A little bit. You? Uh, same. Just having a roof over my head. You know, I've always dreamed of fixing up a farm just outside of Jackson. Why wouldn't you stay in town? I don't know. I like the idea of real space. That sounds lonely. Only if you're doing it alone. Okay. So are we gonna, like, raise sheep and milk cows? Are you making fun of me? <laughs> no. It actually sounds kind of nice. Really? Yeah. 
Really? They keep building up Ellie and Dina's relationship and tossing all these hints to a potential future, but just makes me worried that something bad's gonna happen to one of them. Well, that was an adventure. Haven't found any of them yet. Hey, it's a big city. We barely started looking. Yeah, I know. Just thought we'd see one of them by now. Look like there was a way to get onto this here. Might be the way we're supposed to go. Oh, definitely is. Okay. Didn't take me as long as I'd expect. The military got their ass kicked here. WLF. <laughs> These guys don't fuck around. <clears throat> Nothing there, but I think we just have to climb up over here. Dude, easy jump, don't worry. Worrying's in my blood, so. Is Dina coming, or is she just gonna hang out? Maybe she's just gonna hang out. I feel like there's a lot of stuff over here. Okay, there's this. Oh, fall off an edge while holding to repel down. Okay, well, I don't want to do that yet. Man, check this out. This thing's a relic. There we go. Yeah, definitely. The other one's almost gone. Can't climb up. Oh, there's this dude. Guess there's nothing, nothing to be done with him. I thought we were going to be able to cross right there. So I guess I just jump. Uh, Ellie? Yeah? Do you know what you're doing? I think so. Wait, R and L1 to swing? Where am I swinging? Oh, this is how I get up to there, the place I wanted to go before. It felt like some spot that I'd be able to get to, so... Ooh, almost missed it. Got it! There really is endless exploring in this area. Well, we got that up there. Do I just drop off? I guess so, huh? Back on the search for more loot. Potential agents. Feels like we should be getting up there somehow. Just gotta find a way to do it. Should we get this gas back to the fuck over here? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank goodness they said that. I forgot about the generator that was out of gas. The entire purpose for us being here. At least I found one last bit of loot, though, instead of heading straight back immediately. Can't gallop anymore. Hey, appreciate you. Hey, these old generators are pretty finicky, so it might take you a few tries to. Oh. Sorry, go on. Nothing. So this is East Two. Dina's got skill. East Two, five, three, four, five. Easy enough to remember. Five. Three. 
four, five. It worked. We are cruising. Well, no welcoming committee. Or they're just waiting for us. Let's look for a way in. Keep an eye on those windows. WLF. I get it. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. That explains the drawing on that other piece of paper. Who's breathing so hard? Um, looks like we can climb up into that. Just want to make sure there's nowhere else to go. Ellie, you good? Infected just hopped that fence. Oh, means we can get in that way. Shouldn't we hear gunshots or something? Uh, I don't know what's going on. I wonder if the sound is just glitched or something. So I just uh, restarted from checkpoint just to see if it would fix the breathing. I don't know how loud it was for you all, but it was very loud in my headset and it seems to have solved the issue. So we got each one that we can unlock. So if we're unlocking a gate with a generator, I feel like I probably want to go to that other spot first. kind of tricky to know in these areas which one you're supposed to go first without triggering an event or something. But if we miss an area, we miss an area. We might not even be able to... Oh no, we can. We can climb up on this, but... Okay, so maybe we aren't supposed to go up there after all. It looked like an area that was set up to climb the fence. Maybe we can climb the fence somewhere else. Because they were talking about infected. Oh, here we go. Can I push this? Looks like a normal one that you could push. Uh, no idea what to do here. We can go through the gate, I guess. Maybe we can get over there. I'm an idiot. I was on the spot. I just assumed the rest had barbed wire. Okay, there's one. Doesn't look like there's any others. Anything in here? That other dude just walked straight back in there, so... Nothing to loot. Let me just... Use that. Okay. Now let's fight whatever's in here. About time we get some more action. Oh, we got some boys feasting. Got one Roman. Another, another back there. This one should be an easy get by himself. Let's go 
going through quite the maze here. Okay, one down, three to go. Okay, I will be more careful. Oh, do we have multiple roamers? I see. Okay, that one may go in there. If he does, I'll get this one. No. I have no idea. Oh, come on. You gotta tell me that got one of them. I think it did. These others are just gonna be on flames. In flames, I guess. They're smoking. Peekaboo. Easy enough. As long as there's no clickers that I have to worry about at the okay. same time. That's that. They got a bed. This one's fresh. And he's got one of those wolf patches. Guess they didn't make it out with their gas after all. That's good, right? If those fuckers who killed Joel got taken out by some random infected. Then they'd still be dead, really. I'm not sure that's justice. Yeah, I'd like him to suffer a bit more. What we can while we're here. That would be very interesting if that's what happened to him, but it's not over till we find Abby and Isaac for that matter. And Owen. Although even Owen seemed kind of unsure of Abby's aggressiveness. I feel like we can probably make something, huh? Oh, we can upgrade. Yeah, might as well. Uh, let's make another Molotov since we used one. Let's make two. And we can make a stun. Haven't used one of those yet. I probably should. Interesting dog statues. What you see... Oh, the concierge. Michael Scott's favorite position. When you meet one, it is intoxicating. So some people got back out. They just locked the other dude in there. Kind of messed up. If he's one of their own. Oh, this does not look like a zombie kill. Shot. You recognize him? No. Maybe someone else killed these guys. The infected just wandered in. Could be Tommy. I don't know who else would be killing him. Some decent loot in here. Oh, I thought that was a note. I wonder if there's gonna be like a third faction they introduced to us. That would be hey, kind of wild. Found their gas. Well, if we need any more, we know where to get it. Well, I'm guessing it wasn't the WLF that left. Because they probably would have gotten the gas and taken it with them since that was such a big deal for them. It's gotta be I Tommy. This one either. Thought he was gonna wake up there for a second when he moved. 
This is a nice area here. Doesn't look too bad for it being a couple decades into the apocalypse. Look at us. Never better. Ooh, that's a lot of pills. Is that enough to upgrade? Yes, finally. Oh, it's been a while since I looked. Listen speed, or listen mode, movement speed. Move faster. That's a new upgrade there. I could get that. I feel like I should do this so I can unlock the last one. Oh, okay, you need training manuals to do it. I see. Is there anything in there? I don't think so. It's been a lot of looting over the past little while. I don't have an issue with it though. I find it kind of relaxing. Saturday, March 29th, our strike against the Fedra checkpoint worked, killed at least three of those thugs, just a wounded, just a few wounded on our side. In the wake of our losses, it felt good to hit back. That night, we voted Isaac as the new commander. Interesting, it was a vote. It was a contentious meeting. His summary execution of those prisoners still doesn't sit right with some people, but I like him. He can make the tough calls. You made the wrong choice with him, that's for sure. I'm effing exhausted, but for good reason. But for a good reason, we've had eight new recruits show up in the last few days, and six are Fedra deserters. Isaac's directive is clearly working. It's either that or all those flyers. People are taking us seriously now. Finally seeing the WLF as a real alternative. We'll kick those fascists out and rebuild on the foundations Emma and Jason laid. Oh, man. I think Isaac's methods work because he's so insane. Or seemingly so insane. Know-it-all. Sounds like a match for Chessmaster. Brains 100 plus, it goes more. Braun 20, affiliation Spark, world famous researcher diagnosed with an early form of dementia. Sheila Kim reached out to Spark in desperation. Could they do something to slow her mental decline? They agreed to implant an experimental nano AI drive in her brain, allowing her to not only retain her knowledge, but accrue new information at a massive rate. Now she is arguably the smartest person alive and Spark's new chief technology officer overseeing their military research arm. Some argue that she's lost her conscience. Others wonder whether the AI has taken over her mind. Neutral villain. Interesting. Wonder if there'll be anything special when we get all the cards, if we can play with somebody. Nothing over there. Some more loot. I'm getting more and more worried though, the more notes we find about Isaac without seeing him yet. Shit. He looks alive. The fuck happened here? Never mind. Tommy did this. This? He's one of the ones that killed Joel. I recognize him. Putting those torturing skills Shit. to work Ellie There's was talking about. There's a code. He was using them against each other. How? Joel told me about this. You ask this guy a question, but you don't make him say it. You make him write it down. I remember that scene. When you ask this guy, and if the facts match, truth if not you fuck him up yeah I heard some creaking I hope nobody else is here well that's a cool callback to that technique 
East one. Another gate code? Looks like it. Oh, that's right, because on it's our map it was, like, scribbled out. He can't be far off. Or worn out. Yeah. Or did I say our map? I meant our note. And that's the gate right next to this, right? I think. Come on. We can get out this way. Maybe catch up with Tommy. Yeah. Well, even though he's doing some pretty dark stuff, I'm glad that Tommy's bringing the justice.